song is is going to be approaching November, December. We do you have some information on that, uh, Miss Michelle Hopkins, that you wanted to share. Do you think that grid going down could have something to do with a? Uh, I've heard electronic um, anomalies might happen once it gets real close to Mars on its incoming pass. Um, what do you know about ISON, and, and how, if this is related, how, how so? Okay, let me tell you what I know about ISON. First of all, it's going to be going past Mars with its debris field. And before it even came in uh, to where Mars is, it passed through our solar system's asteroid belt. When it did that, it careened into asteroids that went helter-skelter all over the universe. Some of them went forward in its path toward the world, toward the Earth. Some of them have already hit the Earth. They've already gone down through our atmosphere and burned up and whatnot. Some of them have hit terra firma. We just had a really spectacular view of one that came through our atmosphere and lit up nearly a third of the atmosphere. It was really, really spectacular from space. Um, So we've got that debris coming at us already from the asteroid belt. And this thing that just went through our our, our, uh, atmosphere, it was an asteroid. It was not a meteor. We people think that a meteorite is just you know a smaller asteroid, but no, they're different animals. Uh, an asteroid is, has a different makeup, and it was a small asteroid. Well, it passes with its debris field in Mars in early November, right around November 10th, and it leaves debris all the way through our solar system, um, which you know on its entire path, which. Early next year, the Earth is going to be traveling through. But before that happens, Ison will be traveling uh, past our sun. It's going to kind of ricochet around the sun. It passes several of our planets, and it will probably be throwing asteroids and other debris down on these planets as it goes by. It comes to Earth. uh, Its debris field starts passing by Earth and Earth starts going into, revolving, actually revolving inside Ison's debris field on December 1st of this year. It begins to pass through the debris field. Now, during this time, the entire Earth is going to be affected. Now, we remember that the tail has picked up all these significant asteroids and debris and dust traveling through that asteroid belt, on December 8th, Ison itself passes by. Now, we should be able to really see a spectacular show from the comet. The comet is really huge, and and it's even its tail. On on the 16th of December, Ison will be fully past the Earth, but for 15 days, 15 days, our Earth is going to be revolving in that debris trail for this huge comet. Wow. This this debris field has asteroids and large debris, meteors, meteorites, dust, and all kinds of other debris that are going to be pelting the Earth. And there is one scripture that uh, this reminds me of. It reminds me of the first trumpet. You know, in the first trumpet, it talks about how um, that we're hit with this kind of of debris, okay? And I'm trying to remember the... uh, I I pull it up here. Here it is. Um, In Revelation 8, it talks about the trumpets, okay? And uh, before the first trumpet sounds, it says, The angel took the censer and filled it with fire from the altar and hurled it on the earth. And there came peals of thunder, rumblings, flashes of lightning, and an earthquake. Now, Ison is pretty large. It could cause seismic activity. Definitely flashes of lightning as these things come down through our atmosphere. Rumblings and uh, thunder, possibly, from those flashes of lightning. But the first trumpet says, the angel sounded his trumpet 
and there came hail and fire mixed with blood and it hurled down was hurled down on the earth and when that happens a third of the earth is burned up a third of the trees are burned up and all the green grass was burned up and i've never seen an event in all of history that i'm aware of that this could actually have been fulfilled in the debris field of Ison, I've seen it with my own eyes, what it looks like. This could be fulfilled. 